Welcome back to Golden Nervous Collection. Thank you so much for joining me. Sagittarius, this is going to be your second read for February. Uh, quite a bit going on. You guys had a really weird weekly reading, so we're going to take a look and see what else comes out. For some of you, I know career is um, in the forefront for some of you. Plus, it's also this full moon energy. So let's just see what messages we have for just you right now. And then we'll go in and we'll take a look at your other person, okay? Mm. So the lover's card, first card out, soulmates. I told you two weeks ago, you guys, there's a bunch of people that are getting ready to come back into your lives. Some of them are for healing and some of them are to, I don't know, but whatever this is, Sagittarius, this is a twin flame soulmate for you, okay? I feel like you deserve it, I do. Especially if you've been working on your healing. Sagittarius, that's nice. What else do we have at the bottom of the deck? Magician. So, manifested. Gemini energy here with a magician. Mmm. Mmm. Soul purpose. Something was created, but there's deception around it. But guess what? It doesn't matter because deception is now ending. This compared with this. All right. There's some sort of cycle and there's going to be a new beginning here because this is now the end. There is a cycle here. And I think that the deception was it's the end of juggling. Um, yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That's exactly what it feels like. Uh, it could have been somebody possibly not giving enough to a soulmate situation or... <laughs> Let's just see. Let's see. It's They're jumping out with love immediately for you guys. And I saw a career. And actually, you know, this could be career choices too. I've always seen the lover's card when it comes to career. So you might be a little stressed out about that. You know, but don't manifest anything that's not going to be for your higher purpose is what I feel. Listen, <laughs> you guys, Sagittarius, you guys are... You're doing whatever it is that you need to be doing. You've taken a hold of all of those tools and you're getting ready to create something new. You And see, my, I'm dehydrating sage right now and the beeper just went off. Like I said, you're creating something new. <clears throat> yeah, it's love. It's love. That's awesome. Let's keep this positive for Sagittarius. New beginnings is kind of what I'm feeling. It's what I'm hearing. Yeah, judgment in your favor. Whatever it is that you were trying to create is it's panning out in your favor. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you cannot make it up because you cut something off because you were smart about it. I'm telling you, you manifested the truth. No fire to roam. Mm -hmm. Hero fun. Marriage. You guys are getting married. Queen of Wands, and you're a sexy mofo that knows how to handle business here. Here's the thing. Somebody, but you got somebody jealous around you. I'm just going to say it right now. You got someone jealous around you that's spying on you and really kind of throwing the stank eye and the evil eye at your beauty, at everything that's going on with you. Seriously. Um, you have, uh, man, you cannot make it up. The Empress, the Ace of Wands, and somebody literally trying to come in and, and hate on everything that is abundant for you. Um, it's like they want you to wait for them. Yeah. Yeah. And, and listen, if you were dealing with a relationship here where they were asking you to wait, you don't have to. There, there's, mind ga there's too many mind games and manipulation going on, and that's what that judgment is. There was too much stress because someone wasn't making a decision. This full moon energy, for whatever reason, I feel is a vibration of pain for your other person. I don't feel this is for you. I feel like you have done the work. Again, judgment coming through here, and you left something out in the cold. Okay, what you left out in the cold was this Five of Swords energy. You know, having to fight for a relationship where someone was making you wait or they were invested in other places, okay? I really do feel like whoever this is, I mean, look, this is a woman with her child. She knows where she needs to be vested. She knows what she needs to be working on here, okay? All right, so now if this is a new business opportunity, Be careful because you could be hired in 
I don't know. There was another reading that was like this too um, for Friday Night Love Tarot. Don't you guys forget Friday Night Love Tarot. Check that one out too. There was another reading that had an energy of an employee that was toxic and was causing the new people to quit. So because we do have the, te the devil energy here, and if this is in regards to employment, um, it's a, it, the person is kind of a sugar, honey, iced tea starter, if that makes sense. They just, they cause problems for no reason. So just be on the lookout and be aware. Kind of keep your nose down. If you choose to, you know, take an assignment or if you go contract with somebody, um, however it is you choose to, to handle this particular offer, yeah, there's somebody around that's kind of, they're nosy and they're toxic. So just be aware of that. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they are. And they could cause a tower moment here. But for the most part, this is all happening extremely unexpectedly. I told you, you have victory coming in and it is coming in very, very fast. It is something that you are going to have to protect because, again, you have a player energy around you that wants to take control of the situation. Seriously, they're in regret over losing you is what it feels like. And they could possibly come in and try to cause drama for this new choice, this new opportunity that you have. The confusion that they're going to try to come in, hold on, what confusion are they coming in with? Why is that? It's because they're familiar with you. They're familiar with you. They feel like they invested in you and they want you to come back, even though they were carrying on with the third party and betraying you. This is your justification. They're telling you that they're going to try to make it better for you, but it's not going to be better. Seriously, that relationship is done and over with. And you're stepping into something new, bright, and abundant. And very sexual and passionate as well. Very sexual and very passionate. Um, and this person could be even be a Leo because I saw the Seven of Wands. You could have a Taurus here. Uh, but I also saw the Emperor. This and it because it could be this this person that's coming in is just you know extremely aroused by you. Okay, Sagittarius. Yeah, Ten of Wands. Yeah, they're aroused by you, for sure. Yeah. Hold on, though. They have, they have, mm, is this you? Yeah, listen. Whatever it is that you guys, there's some sort of delay. You guys might be still holding on to a little bit of this love here, okay? But it's someone else's energy around you. And I felt that earlier when I saw this Three of Swords. It's not your energy. Okay, so stay in this high vibration that you guys are being offered by the divine, and I know you feel it, okay? And they're telling you to release heartbreak here from someone that was a player because you have someone new that's getting ready to come in, okay? The vibration the person is sending you, it's clouded, and it causes you to um, delay. I'm telling you, you have an unexpected offer coming in here from somebody. You do. You know what we're yeah see three of cups there's there's more than one person here so i'll tell you what we're going to do we're going to look at your old person and we're going to look at the new person look there's definitely a, a happiness and a revelation of something gorgeous and brand new coming in let me tell you look yeah you're old i just picked up this deck and there's nine of swords at the bottom of the deck and here's the tower moment let's look at the old person please the old person for Sagittarius the star card somebody beautiful yeah but they're in regret Ooh we you guys let me tell you something about this old person here okay and we're not gonna spend too much time on this because you already let it go mm -hmm. hoping and wishing for your downfall look at that treacherous mouth they don't speak ill listen nine of swords there's something that has happened to this person I feel like they have possibly been attacked by magic, okay? There's someone who they are trying to manipulate. I feel like this person could really be good at manipulation as well. They don't come off that way, though. They're very egoic, very egoic, like um, your other person. Yeah, they got plans for you. I told you, there's someone jealous around you. Mm -hmm. There's someone de jealous around you, someone that would lie, and they're making plans that are very, very toxic. And the universe is literally watching this person. I feel like the universe is also kind of handing them 
their butt right now. I, I think I saw that in another reading as well. They're they're manipulative. A beautifully manipulative person that's coming in trying to offer you something brand new here. But listen, the manipulation is is solid. They're a player. Anything else? And they're stuck in their ways. They're at the crossroads right now. Mm hmm They, you know what? They they love you though. Okay. And they're tripping off of the fact that you now have a choice to move into marriage and to release certain burdens here. Mm -hmm. This person wants to keep you bound and stuck in their manipulation. And but they're going to plan on they're planning on continuing being this player. Mm hmm Yeah, I told you. They this is you, Temperance. This is you. You, you know what's crazy is I'm going to pull you out of that. I'm not even going to leave you in this energy anymore. Let them stay stuck in this Eight of Swords. We don't need to look at this anymore. Okay? That person is gone. That person is long gone. Bottom of the deck. Two of six. You have new plans to be making. Okay? You just know that this person is trying to keep you stuck and keep you, you know, in that particular state of mind. Just be aware. I'm, I'm telling you, you better watch your back with this one. This, there's something not right about this person here. And they're thinking about it. They're contemplating on whatever it is that they either chose to mess up, but they're still, they're in a very, very toxic cycle because of the things that they have done. They want to, listen, I'm going to tell you, they want to heal it with you, but it's never going to be healed because of their mentality. It would just keep you stuck. Tell me about the new person. Tell me about the new energy. Ooh, unexpected. I'm telling you guys, unexpected. Six of Wands, it's that same victory that just came out with this sunshine. Nine of Wands for you, Sagittarius energy. Three of Swords. Mm -hmm. For some of you guys, you're... Okay, hold on. Because we got five of wands that just came out with conflict. And then we have ace of cups. Okay, so whoever this is coming in, you got to be careful. They're, they're telling you the truth about this one. There is devil energy here. There's a very sexual relationship here. This is hot, heavy, heated, sexual relationship. The, the, what this person is fearing, basically. This person that's hating on you. Whatever this is, there's going to be some sort of unexpected um, conflict that comes in regards to this relationship because there's going to be some sort of betrayal here. Yeah, look, this Three of Swords again. Uh, I don't know if it's this other person coming in to... I feel like for some reason this person might not be coming around you because of this person. I don't know why. But at the same time, yeah, because this person's trying to hold on to you. Scorpio energy. But there's also someone else that's tried to manipulate this relationship and possibly call you in in some way. Possibly candle magic here. A Scorpio. And that very sexual energy, okay? Third party. There's three of swords that just fell on top of this. Okay, so who this new person. Oh my god. You guys, this new person is a twin flame, but they're a player too. Uh, how unfortunate. So really, I feel like this person is toxic too. Just that's why there's a tower moment coming in with this new opportunity. This person is a player here. You, but this vibration over here, you still need to release this anyway. It doesn't matter. All right. There's this tower moment that's coming in with this Capricorn relationship here. Scorpio. You also, this Libra. Hmm. It's like a karmic thing. Okay. Because this is Saturn and Libra. There's a truth that's going to be coming out. So I don't feel like this is going to happen very quickly. I don't, the devil wanted this to, this little union to come in here. They really did. There's something toxic 
about whatever is going on with this particular person and the way that they love. They do give to more than one person. They, they're just telling you off the bat. Whatever it was that you left from over here, the next person is, is going to have kind of the same mentality for some particular reason. Yeah, two of coins, juggling. They're going to have the same type of mentality as the last person. That's, 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 wow. Can't even make it up. Player and juggling. Making plans. But there's got to be some sort of judgment here. Yeah. Listen, I'm telling you. This judgment is that you're, you're doing all right. Okay? Justice is coming in. Allowing you to realize that loyalty is something that you are deserving of. It's going to be in your favor. Okay? Being stuck in someone's mind games and ego is not what you want. You'd rather be by yourself. And that you're going to take action. I feel like you're just going to educate yourself. You're going to continue to love yourself. You're going to do pretty well. Wow. This other person is given to other people. What else do we got? But I'm telling you guys, it's generational. It's literally generational. It's it's almost like you're supposed to be healing this person in a way with this Nine of Cups and this uh, Ace of Cups. There's a Ten of Cups aspect here. Oh, you know what's crazy is for some of you guys, this other person could be going through something extremely toxic too. And they have a breakup situation where their person is, you know, toxic around them. And so they need this healing. Okay. There is a divine twin flame relationship here in their energy when it's talking to you. But for some reason, this person is heartbroken as well. Okay. Any other information about this other person? They could be a player, but it's because they're heartbroken. Between Sagittarius and the new person, any other stuff? King of Pentacles, Five of Cups. Yeah, you guys could have been dealing with an earth sign here. There's someone who's in a whole lot of regret. Yeah, it's a, to me, I feel like this is a... Both of these people are broken masculines, or they could be feminines, but they're people who are really on top of their game, who have businesses, who own their own homes. You know, they take care of things, but they've just been betrayed. You know, or they feel like they've been betrayed. And so judgment comes in here and then they they just think to themselves, oh, well, it makes sense to, to just talk to multiple people here. Let me just pay attention to my work. And I mean, I know that all too well, guys. I totally pay attention to work and don't really worry about multiples. You know what I mean? Total hermit energy. So, I mean, there's going to be some sort of conversation that's coming out here. You know, and, and I really, I feel like for some of you guys, there could be, I feel like there's death here. There's death. That's what this tower moment is with this other person. Someone could have lost someone to murder or there's a, there's an energy here of your other person actually goes through some sort of toxic tower moment that causes them a lot of pain, regret, and grief. And honestly, what's crazy is at that moment, you may even step into their life and help them to balance their energy out after they've gone through this toxic energy or this death. Mm -hmm. Somebody feels trapped here. They feel trapped. They feel like they can't get out of the system. Mm-hmm. And they have a lot of regrets over the way things went in the past. They have a lot of regrets over what's stable, what's not stable. I think this person also has a really hard time trying to find work. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and they worry about their abundance. And so their abundance is one of the reasons why they're running back and forth. Mm -hmm. Interesting. Somebody used to... If you used to think that your other person was running back and forth all the time, it's not always what it was. There were certain secrets that they kept for you, but for the most part, they had slowed down. They were just dealing with people so that they could make money. Mm. I don't know why. Tell me about this. Yeah. Somebody's leaving. You guys, someone is leaving their life. 
okay? But I, I will tell you this. They don't want you, and Spirit does not want you really getting mixed up with this new person here. Go on ahead and take care of yourself at this time. There's there's definitely something unexpected that's getting ready to happen in your relationship. I don't know why. For some of you guys, I'm feeling, that, but there's something that's off, okay, about this new direction and this new path, and you're really stressed out about it. Again, I, I feel like it's other people's vibrations you're picking up on. Some of you guys are empaths. They don't want you in this tower moment when it happens. For some of you guys, I I feel like this is the old person too. They want to come back to you. And there's going to be some sort of tower moment that's happening with this particular person because of their their tendencies. I don't see that actually working out. They do love you, but they need you to be in a relationship where they can come and go as they please and have multiple people. That's not working for you. So again, you're going to stay over here. You know that there's an unexpected offer coming in, but I don't feel it's one that you want to entertain. Um, until you're happy. You have this happiness, this bright energy coming in here. Okay? You, I feel like there is a relationship that you see around you. Um, you see the toxicity in it. Okay, with this devil energy. Somebody's trying to control you with this quick king of wands here. Okay? Somebody's trying to control you. They really do think about you from the past. And I'm, that's another thing. That somebody is spying on you. I definitely see that. Could be a Leo energy. Mm -hmm. Who wants to take action. Somebody might want to tell you something too. Could be a Leo who wants to talk to you. Yeah. So I see that communication. That'll be coming in within the next week or so. Yep. About a choice that was made here this lover's energy and some sort of multiple option, multiple option or confusion, multiple option. Somebody's unsure and uncertain about their path and how they're going to be moving forward here. You're going to have to make this choice pretty quickly when it comes to this relationship. And I'll tell you what, if you choose not to take this person back, it's going to break their heart, but there's nothing that you can do about it. There was too much toxicity in the past. I don't, Tell me about this Six of Pentacles. Will this ever work out? Six of Pentacles chariot. That same chariot that's right here. Somebody's going to be moving forward and moving on. Moving on to what? And it's you. Temperance, I told you, you're not going to be held back. You are continuing, t continuously growing. You're ascending is what I feel. And this is what this love relationship here, this new person, whether it's the old person or not, but this new person is going to make you ascend even more. Probably a lot faster than this person did too. I mean, technically you do have the star card here, but with this five of swords, the things that they say to you are not real. It's like they're an actor, okay? If that makes sense. They're acting. They're not telling the truth about what it is that they're truly planning, okay? You could be, and it has to do with money. This person is, is materialistic and money motivated. You could be dealing with a Taurus, Capricorn, or a Virgo there. Yeah, someone who cannot stop thinking about you. They cannot. They want to come towards you. All right, but you are going to be moving forward here. There's also some sort of an abundance thing. You guys, this new person might be offering you things. I see someone buying. I see someone buying Sagittarius a car here. Yep. Yep. Could be a. Um, yeah, this emperor is getting ready to come in here. Yeah, somebody wants to protect you. Somebody wants you. And and not only that. It's not just someone wants to protect you. It's this Aries energy that you're going to be stepping into as well. Because what's going to happen is you're going to take control of your situation and you're going to buy yourself this car. You're going to be like, you know, I think I'm just going to treat myself and make myself happy here with this Ten of Cups. Ace. I'm going to love on myself, take care of myself. I'm, yeah, some of you guys are buying yourselves a new car. Okay. You know what? I think I said that a while ago. You get a car. I get a car. We all get a car. <laughs> So it's coming in, boo. It's coming in. Brand new off the lot. I'm hearing fresh. Ooh, that fresh leather. Okay? Come on. Fresh leather. No cloth. No cloth. We're, we're, no, no cloth. <laughs> oh, my. Mm, mm, mm. Okay. Yep. And you know what? For, for some of you with that car, I see you going to a friend and asking for help with the sale. I see that car coming in for you, so it's gonna be all good. Your boats are already in row for that. It's on. It's happening, see? See those little sprouts there in the corner? 
yeah it's on its way you just got to leave stuff like this alone and this moon cycle though with this new energy I could tell you this new person whatever is you know the Virgo full moon this person's going through it right now they really are yeah they're going round and round they're going back and forth yep they're in drama they're in drama they might even see you driving somewhere that's another thing they might even see you driving somewhere and like they they just broke up with somebody they're heartbroken they're a little pissed off but what's crazy is they're in they're in their emotions so I, they might even be mad when you meet this person hopefully it's not a car accident or something but it's it's just one of those moments yeah i'm telling you it's one of those moments four of wands this person is going to literally see you and just immediately want to talk to you like who are you where have you been all my life wow Sagittarius, so you know take yeah take it as it resonates take it as it resonates hold on there's some deception here though I told you there is some deception here so be careful with this person when they come in smooth talking and all okay make sure you're smart about that and don't get played do not get played for some reason I'm hearing it's gonna be a small world and they may even know your ex uh-huh and they're gonna know whatever it is that you tell them about that past relationship is the truth and that's why they're gonna fall in love with you and want to be your husband literally that's what I see look temperance in the Emperor husband and wife moving forward can't make it up all right let's yeah ten of coins I told you you can't make it up this is someone who is destined to be in your life just make sure that they're taking care of you and treating you properly and treating you right of course you guys know the Vimeo extended link is going to be below we go over there we look at this other person's headspace some more and then um, what their intentions are going to be even further if this resonated for you I'm gonna clear this out a little bit and separate it out and see if there's a second person here if they're really just a player because there's definitely player energy here okay but for whatever reason with this temperance energy here and being able to move forward somebody don't doesn't want to be a player anymore I mean literally and finding you man <sighs> boom angel baby it's like a blessing it's a gift Okay, for some of you, depending on, you know, you you might even get, you guys are supposed to be destined to have a child together. And it doesn't, an angel baby doesn't necessarily mean a child. You guys, ten of pentacles, right? Ten of pentacles at the bottom of the deck. Yeah, that's that judgment coming in. You guys might even be, end up having a business together of some sort. Okay, so yeah, getting rid of the old, man, you cannot make it up. I told you, shedding the old light, the divine feminine is seeking the light okay intuitive blessed messages coming through I feel like you definitely have mothering guidance that's here all right yeah this person is coming back to make you an offer up here so you guys need to be on the lookout for that this you don't even see this coming this is totally unexpected over here so hopefully it doesn't all happen at the same time yeah but this person over here there's a there's a pretty bad breakup for this person and I feel like when this person sees you, they're going to see you at some point, but they're not going to see you. Does that make sense? Like, I don't know. I don't know how to even say it. Like, they'll meet you one particular time and then they catch you again some other time later. And they're like, don't I know you? And yeah, there's a couple of different scenarios that I see for you guys here. But it doesn't matter because right now, truly, the only thing that you're working on is taking care of you okay tranquility boost energy okay yeah healing yourself healing yourself from things that had gone wrong in the past any sort of confusion clearing all of this up all right so that when this person does come in and make this offer you'll be able to see very clearly what it is third eye intuition all right. I love you, Sagittarius. Thank you so much for joining me. If this resonated, make sure you check out the Vimeo extended link below. Hit that like button and the bell because you never know when I'm going to upload. <laughs> Peace and elbow grease.